guys, it's me, Myri Bond, and I am back with another video. You Today is Friday, May 17th, and it's currently 4.25 p.m. And as you guys can probably tell from the title, I have a new baby here. And I'm going to be doing the blanket reveal right now. The blanket reveal right now. And then after I do the blanket reveal, you guys are going to see me actually open up the baby. And the box opening is going to be at the end of this video. So, yeah. <laughs> The reasoning for that is because I got this baby as a custom painted kit, so it did not arrive put together. And so I just finished putting the baby together right now. And uh, honestly, I got this baby last week, Friday. It's another Friday. <laughs> but I've been super busy with work and I haven't had time to put this baby together, which is why there was a delay. So yeah, you guys are kind of seeing this baby, you know, a little bit late, but better late than never, right? So, um, I'm going to do the blank reveal, then I'm going to put the video of me opening the baby at the end, and then I'm also going to do a first outfit change changing video, which will not be in this video, it'll be in the next video. So this video won't be too long. I don't remember how long the unboxing was, but yeah. Anyways, let's get started. This baby actually can barely fit on the boppy, so. <laughs> okay, start with the legs. And I actually never done a box opening video like this. I've never done like a blank reveal and then the actual box, box unboxing at the end. Sorry, I'm like tongue twisted. Anyways, you guys can probably tell what kit this is from the legs, maybe. But from the arms, and hands when you see them you're gonna be like oh i know that kit definitely so here are the legs very very chunky legs this baby is super heavy like i said i just finished putting this baby together and ugh, let me tell you it took me about an hour to put this baby together <laughs> and i am probably going to take the head off and restuff the baby and um, redo the head as well just not right now. I have zero energy for that right now. So yeah. But anyways. Look how cute. And I just can't get over how realistic the bottom of feet look. Oh. So cute. Okay. Look at the arms. You guys can tell who this is from the hands, can't you? I just can't believe how realistic this baby is. As well as how the artist was able to capture everything I want. Also, again, the baby is going to be a little bit stiff because I just, literally just got done from cutting the zip ties. And yes, this baby is naked. And um, this is not the body that the kit comes with. This is a body I already had. And I just used this because the kit, when I bought the kit, it didn't come with the body. But yeah. Oh, let me zoom in on the nails, guys. Hopefully my camera doesn't start acting weird because sometimes it acts a little weird when I try to focus it or zoom in. But man, those details on the nails. So realistic. I'll take you guys down so you guys can get a better look at it. All right. Also, I do have the light on, so the baby might look a little bit weird. Usually I just use the natural lighting. But I do got the light on. All right, you guys ready for the face? All right. One, two, three. Look who it is. <laughs> Big, chunky baby. I think I might take some stuffing out. Now that I'm looking. <laughs> now that I'm looking at him, I think I overstuffed him. <laughs> Little big, chunky baby. Do you guys know who this is? This is Missy by Natalie Blick. And mine is a boy. I did say he kind of spoiled it a little bit. But I know, even with all that gorgeous hair, this is a baby boy. Yeah, I'm definitely going to take some stuff in y'all. Yeah, not right now though. But yeah, probably it's on the sides. So if I take out the stuffing on the sides, this is how, this is how he'll look. 
But yeah, that's Missy. So cute. I'm covering up the number because I think I said this in my uh in the unboxing. People are like, don't show the numbers, you're the reason why the COAs are getting stolen and don't show the COA and all this other stuff. So I'm like, I don't need y'all yelling at me. But yeah, this is my little baby boy. And then look at that hair. It's a mess right now. I know. Don't judge. But look how beautifully rooted this hair is. Okay. Another confession. He's been sitting limbs, limbs on the floor for a week. So that's why he looks like crazy. But when you guys see like me opening him up, you can definitely see all of his beauty and all of his cuteness. My little over big fat stuffed baby. So no one's fault but mine. <laughs> Okay, but that's Missy. So cute. But yeah, I've had a week with him. Not really though, since he wasn't put together, but he got a lot of stuffing in his hair. But he's so cute. Absolutely adorable. I can't wait to get a chance to actually play with him, but his head's even gonna be even more stiff when I take that zip tie off and re-weigh him for like the third time okay but yeah that's missy and um this is his blanket reveal and i'm gonna quickly change him and yes i can get this uploaded by tomorrow so yeah if i didn't say at the end of this video well keep watching because the video's not over but if i didn't say at the end hey guys it's me my reborns and i am back with another video Today is Friday, May 10th, and it's currently 1.44 p.m. And I just got home a few minutes ago, and I had got a notification about an hour ago that showed that I had a package that arrived, which I am very ex excited. Sorry, guys. I'm very excited about. I remember this, there was like four times because I kept forgetting stuff. I was getting hot, so I took my sweater off, but then I ran back down back up because i remember i had to get the scissors and i was like okay well i might as well wash my hands too so i'm out of breath but i am very happy that this package had arrived very very fast shipping from dhl i gotta give you guys a round of applause because they got the package wednesday and it's friday so two days shipping <laughs> thought only amazon prime could do it or walmart guys walmart shipping is fantastic you can get stuff in a day or two with them. Anyways, I'm so happy that this package arrived. When I first pulled up into the driveway and into the garage, I looked at the front door to see if I see any packages. I did not. So I was like, oh, where's the package? Hopefully it got delivered to the right place. But when I opened the door, it was right there. It was like hidden in the corner. Plus it's a small box. But I'm happy that this package arrived because my name is spelled wrong, which is okay. But also the address spelled wrong like one of the words but i'm glad they knew what they meant all right anyways i'm off of work today so i'm also happy about that there's nothing better than getting a baby and you don't work especially getting a baby early but yeah this baby came oh yeah there there is a baby in here but this baby came an hour ago but i wasn't home it literally came right when I was leaving from babysitting. Okay. I'm cutting it open off camera so no address just shows. Okay. Warning. This is just the kit. I have to put the baby together. So, it's just the kit. I know some people don't like seeing the doll kit so you can fast forward to the end to see the baby on like the actual body and things like that anyways okay we got a leg oh i love that coloring i absolutely love that coloring so realistic as well on the pictures the baby skin tone was a lot lighter but this is the perfect skin tone that i wanted 
just like the reference pictures as well. So that's good. Probably has those nice, fancy, high quality lightings that kind of like lights that like wash the pictures and things out. But this is the color that I wanted. So I'm glad she was able to achieve that. The baby has veins and look at that foot. You guys can't tell me this is not a real baby's foot. Look at those nails. Wow. Okay. When I picked this artist, I knew they were going to do an amazing job. But honestly, if I'm being like completely honest, I was not expecting this. I was not expecting the baby to have such lifelike features and look extremely real. I'm sorry, I I was just not expecting this. Super realistic. Okay. Okay, okay. And hopefully I have enough glass beads because I did not order any more, which I know I probably should have, but I didn't. Also, I like this texturing. It's not super heavy, but it's not like where I feel like the baby will get shiny. Oh my gosh, look at that. Look at that foot. I wonder if you guys can guess the kit based off the legs and the feet. Probably the hands. I know the hands for sure we give it away. But if you can guess the baby off of the feet, you guys are A1. I had bought this kit secondhand. I did not have it at first. I bought it from this really, really nice uh, collector and artist. And she was able to ship it out the country for me and everything. She was amazing. Here's the left arm, you guys. This is the dead giveaway. Hand and arm. and Look at that. It's like, I always, I have a weird thing where like, if the hands are like, what is it called? If the hands are like expressive, I just be recreating it. So, just like, ignore my dirty nails. I'm a hardworking woman. <laughs> Anyways, this is the, left arm sorry if i don't seem too excited guys i'm extremely tired i've been up since seven in the morning and i woke up early yesterday and i have to wake up early tomorrow too so extremely tired but here's the right arm and hand look at those fingers this is a real baby real baby real baby <laughs> this one's like My nails are so dirty. I should not be doing this right now. But I do have to say, I do like the texture. But there's just something about like the really, really heavy texture that I just love. Like Saint, his texture is like my favorite. But this baby texture is like a in between from Saints and like Milano's because Milano's is like a I don't know. His is like super oh i just gave away the gave away the kit milano's is like super smooth yeah anyways there's no body in here i don't know why but i thought the baby came with body so now i have to order the baby body but i might i might i have bodies here so i think i might put this baby on a body that i have here and then order a different body I don't think I have a body. I want to say I don't think I have a body that fits. But I think I do. Because I have three months Joseph. And I think I got a body for him. And he's like the same size as this baby. Okay. Anyways. You guys ready for the face? One, two, three. Can you, you guys can probably tell who it is by the lips. Look at those lips. Oh, oh my god. Oh my gosh, he's so cute. Okay, wait, because I wanted this baby to be a boy. But it's kind of giving girl a little bit. Oh my gosh, look at that beautiful rooting. This artist is amazing. Look at that. I'm definitely getting more babies from her. Before she stops painting vinyl. I'm, I definitely got to give me like at least three more. Wow, look at those ears. I think I might get him some earrings. This isn't the texture I was going for, but 
I think this might be a better like envision that I ha didn't have because <laughs> I think this fits him a lot better look at that look at his eyes and then I asked for this little scratch right here she did not disappoint I don't know there's something about me and scratches like whenever I get a custom I'm sorry a baby has to, my baby has to have a scratch somewhere but I can't get over this hair look at that his hair is like Milano's and Solano's. It's like one hair per hole. And then it's also like a, you can part it and it literally looks like a scalp. And you can part it and literally do like hairstyles. Like any way, any direction you can part it and it, it looks real. That is the type of work I love and the quality that I love. And look at those eyebrows and eyelashes. Beautiful absolutely stunning and look at that look at the inside you can see it's rooted one hair per hole you probably really can't see it though but oh he's so cute i wasn't sure if i was going to bond and i was like i don't know guys this baby might be up for sale looking at him in person yeah he's not going anywhere for now this is my baby <laughs> okay anyways if you guys don't know the kit the kit is Missy by Natalie Blick. Showed out limited edition. You can still find the blank. Before you could find the blank like every time you go on like a reborn page or something like that. Now it's kind of getting a little harder to find a blank. But you can still definitely find a blank somewhere. But he is. Oh, I don't know. I was going to show you guys. But I heard they say don't show the COAs. They're like don't show the COAs. They're going to copy. Well, they're already doing that. So <laughs> clearly that's not the problem. Anyways, this baby's 560. Now there was another Missy blank that I was going to get because I was like, why when I want the kit, I can't find nobody buying it. But like a month ago before I wanted the kit, everybody was selling it. I could not find the kit. But then there was somebody that was selling it, but their COA had like, okay, this writing is different, but that COA had like pen writing. That's not pen writing. So I'm like, oh, I'm not going to get that. If the COA looks funny, I'm not going to get it. Because, like, why does yours have pen writing and no one else's does? But anyways, this is Missy by Natalie Blick. And I am going... I should have asked if the baby had a body. Because I could have sworn Missy came with a body. But maybe they used the body for something else. Or uh, just didn't send it. Which is okay. I got this baby blank kit. It's probably a lot of money to those that only pay, like, retail price. But for the kit to be sold out, I feel like I got this baby for a really good price. And she she sent it to a different country and didn't charge extra shipping for it either. So I was like, oh my gosh, you're the best. But anyways, I'm going to go see if I can find a body and like put this baby on a body so I can end this video and post it tomorrow. But yeah. Oh, I didn't ask for a, I didn't ask for a magnet. But then again, it's... Mm, Maybe he doesn't need one. You could maybe do a cut. Or I, I sometimes, I really don't even put pacifier, pacifiers in my baby's mouth anymore. Anyways, I hopefully, fingers crossed for a body that's big enough because this baby's 23 inches. And then fingers crossed for enough glass beads. I know I have some, but is it enough? Mm, mm, mm. I'll be right back, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and if you guys want to follow me on Instagram, you guys can do so at my Instagram rewards, and if you like this video, give a big thumbs up. Comment below if you guys want the comments, including video requests, remember to subscribe to my channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button, also ring that bell so you guys can always be notified when I post another video, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!